Hi, welcome to JotForm. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how to create a MailChimp signup form on JotForm. And yes, you can create these forms to move all your email contacts that sign up on your form or opt-in form to MailChimp so you can later use them for email marketing purposes. So let's jump over to my desktop and show you how that's done right now. All right, to get started, let's create a brand new form so we can connect it to our MailChimp account. So let's go to create form. Let's start one from scratch, a classic form. And let's add our elements into this simple form for testing purposes. So let's go into elements and we're going to ask for the names, the email, and maybe we can add something like a short text like, like this. We can say, how did you find us? All right. And it's a simple form. Let's go into settings now. When inside settings, we're going to go into integrations and we're going to search for MailChimp. So let's scroll down and here's MailChimp. So let's click on MailChimp. We have to authenticate so this way they know that JotForm wants to connect to MailChimp. So let's click authenticate. Let's log into our account that we're going to use for this. Let's allow JotForm to connect to MailChimp. All right, and now that it's connected, um, we already created a form on MailChimp. So in this case, let's go into create a list. Let's go into the JotForm list that we already have created. Let's select an interest group right here. So in this case, I'll select the emails group right here. And now we have to match our fields. So for example, we created the name fields, we created the email and a short text. So for example, email address is already connected to email. Let's add a brand new field. And for example, the full name will be the name address. And that way we can connect fields with how we're going to match them on MailChimp. So once you're ready, we can go into the options right here. Do you want them to always be subscribed? So for example, send them to MailChimp or only if user agrees. So we can add a checkbox to let them agree. In this case, we're just going to select always and let's complete the integration. All right, let's wait for that to integrate. And there we go, it's ready. So let's click on finish and that is already integrated. So let's go ahead and publish this form and we're going to embed it in this case. So let's go ahead and embed this form we just created. Let's copy this code and we have a WordPress site ready right here. So let's work with this sample page. Click on edit. Let's scroll all the way down here. Let's add a brand new block and we have to add the custom HTML. We're going to grab the embed code over there. Let's update it. And let's go ahead and preview this in a new tab. So let's go down here and here's a form we just created. So now we can just fill this form. For example, George Aguilar. And how did you find us? Um, jot form and the email address. So let's go ahead and submit. It's going to wait. And there we go. It's submitted. Now this form, the, the, the what we filled out, is sent to MailChimp. And in this way, we have integrated with our jot form uh, form or opt in form into MailChimp. So it's pretty cool that we have that. Now let's go view how this go, how this looks on MailChimp. All right, so here we have our MailChimp. Let's refresh it. And there we go. Here is what we just filled out on our job form. And it's right here. So the first name, last name, and the emails right here. So we have that integrated there. So it's super easy to integrate your job form form into MailChimp by integrating right here. So there you go. Thank you for watching. My name is George. Remember, this is job form. See you later.